Hello, everybody. Good to be with you. I want to share a meditation with you today, a guided meditation uh, that I've been working with lately on my own. And uh, then on Sunday, I did it with a group of people in satsang. And I think I've got it about to the point now where uh, I'd like to try it out on a wider basis, a broader basis, and see, uh, see if it's beneficial to you. I hope so. So just go ahead and close your eyes. Begin to let the body relax. If the body is not keen on relaxing, be okay with that. Body's doing just what it's supposed to be doing. The body can never really get things wrong. So I want you to imagine now that you're floating on your back on a perfect blue-green sea. There's not a wave in sight anywhere and there's no land in sight either. You're just floating, held, uh, held aloft, held, held up by the ocean, embraced by the ocean, supported by the ocean. Sun is warm on your chest and your face. Front of your legs. Just resting very, very easily. The water is about the same temperature as your skin. So it's hard to tell where the water ends and the skin begins or vice versa. Now I want you to go ahead and breathe outward, a deep exhale. And feel the body as it slips beneath the surface and slowly begins to drift toward the white, sandy bottom. No fish, no coral, no nothing, just white sand as far as the eye can see. Just blue-green sea, as far as the eye can see. Now I want you to feel the sand as it hits your back, as you come into contact with it. It's very soft, it's very fluffy sound, sand. It's almost like powder. There's just a plume around you as you nestle into the sand. I want you to relax in the sand, somehow breathing easily, perfectly at rest, perfectly supported, perfectly safe. Now I want the thoughts that arise, 
I'd like for you to slip them each one of those thoughts into a translucent silvery bubble. And as a thought arises, let that bubble go to the top. Let it wind its way through the water, through the depths, up to the surface where you can see the sunlight. And let each thought bubble, as it breaks the surface, let it go ahead and pop open. And let it reveal that it was an empty bubble. And many thoughts are flowing. They're moving into bubbles. They're drifting upward. Long line of bubbles, flurry of bubbles, random bubbles containing random thoughts, just thoughts that arise in reference to the conditions, internal and external, that exist in that moment at the bottom of the sea. And let that whole train of bubbles break the surface one at a time, two at a time, three at a time. Let them pop open to divulge that each bubble was actually empty. We see that there are no true thoughts We see that there are no difficult thoughts. We're unhindered by them as long as we don't stop them or slow them down. Thoughts arise, bubble it, let go, let it pop. See that it was an empty bubble. What is it that's watching that bubble? All of those bubbles as they arise to the surface. They seem to just come out of the sand or all around the body. What is it that sees that? What is it that allows you to see that? What is it that allows you to hear this voice? To have this visualization? To feel the sea around you? Something is watching, isn't it? Something's watching the bubbles. But tell me true. Isn't there something that's watching the something that's watching the bubbles? Isn't there another watcher, a much more subtle watcher? Deep back, deep back. Something that's watching the body. Something that's watching the movie of a body with its bubbles, of a sea with its sand.
Notice that watcher. And now I want you to allow bubbles to completely encompass the body from head to toe, every square inch, every millimeter. I want you to see the body just completely encased in a thousand bubbles. And then I want you to let those bubbles go. Just relax, they'll go on their own. All you have to do is just relax just a little. You don't need to push them. Let them relax just a little. You relax just a little and the bubbles relax their grip and move toward the surface. In a steady, thick stream of bubbles. And as they hit the surface, each bubble pops. And you see that each of those bubbles pops too. And it's empty. But when you look down, you see that there's no body on the bottom of the ocean. But that consciousness still rests there. But there's consciousness also looking down at that consciousness, isn't it? You can see the consciousness above the water. You can see the consciousness below the water. What is it that sees that? What is it that can actually observe consciousness? Consciousness arrives just before manifestation. But there is something prior to consciousness. There's something there watching, neutral, accepting, It has no body, it has no thoughts, it has no feelings, world perception is seen by using the body. And that which is seeing cannot see itself. It does everything looking outward. Your attention is looking outward, outward, always outward, always for something. Take your attention now and look back. Feel consciousness as it turns. What is it that sees that consciousness? Can you find any separation between you and consciousness? Can you find any boundary between you, the subtle watcher, and anything else? 
Do you have a boundary? Look, the ocean has no boundary. The ocean floor has no boundary. Just ocean forever and ever. Just ocean floor sand, white sand forever and ever. No limits, no boundaries. What is this very substance of the ocean and of the sand? Is the ocean wet? Compared to what? If there's only ocean, you can't compare it to an imagined dryness. What is, is. There is no what isn't. This substance is not wet. Mm -hmm. It's not dry. It's beyond comparison. It cannot be any way other than the way it is because it is beyond alternatives. Release everything now, even ocean, even sand, even the thought of boundaries. When everything else is gone, what's left? disappears, what's left? When form vanishes, what's left? What is it that never moves? What is it that neither comes nor goes? What is it that's rock solid, absolutely steady? No matter whether the sea boils and storm, or bakes in calm. What is it? That is already silent. That is already still. That is always already here. Now,
continue sitting, eyes closed, body relaxed for as long as you wish. Thank you for your precious attention.